A great book for a great apostle. This is Codex Pauli, a unique compilation of Saint Paul's manuscripts. The 428 pages of Codex Pauli are considered to be one of a kind. A thick book that pays tribute to the unforgettable Apostle of the Gentiles in light of the bimillennium birth of Saint Paul. We are accepting the Pope's invitation to make Saint Paul relevant. We decided to do it not only by publishing two well-known letters, but by publishing them in the most beautiful way. The volume has a similar style to that of the ancient monistic codexes, or manuscripts. It's enriched with a special selection of miniature adornments and illustrations. Codex Pauli is inspired by the Carolingian Bible of the 9th century, a treasure that is kept in the Basilica of St. Paul outside the walls in Rome. They had the idea of using the images of the Carolingian Bible to illustrate this great edition of St. Paul's manuscripts that includes letters and other writings from the first century that have to do with him. We are publishing the word of the Lord in a new way by using images to tell the story. It's a book of great spiritual and artistic value that is unmatched because aside from the abbot at St. Paul outside the walls, other scholars who study St. Paul of Christian denominations around the world have also contributed. We've consulted with other experts from other disciplines, like the history of Christianity and art, because St. Paul has a lot to do with art and architecture. In fact, he referred himself as his community's architect. We are all part of a family, a great family, that can't be divided, that can't close itself off. Each one has to live the riches of Christianity. It's like a mosaic, which we all take part in, and that gives glory to God. We must be apostles of Christian ecumenism in the world. Anglicans, the Orthodox and Catholics have collaborated to render this one-of-a-kind tribute to an apostle they share, a mosaic made up of different pieces joined by a fearless apostle, St. Paul, a way to mark this year a historic tribute to the birth of St. Paul.